welcome back. I was asked to give some additional information on the reservoir besides for what I had. And in particular, they wanted the numbers and the analytics. So I have found them. There, there will be some new challenges coming out in reference to the reservoir. I'm just trying to figure out what I'm going to do. I already did the one for the 48 hours for the drip birthday or anniversary, whichever you want to choose to use, which was if you put in a point one B and B, you would receive a drop, excuse me, a drip token. So I'm just coming up. I know Ray from the Buttertown conglomerate is doing a challenge. He's going to do one B and B per day into the reservoir. Thomas G from crypto talk is going to do a hundred B and B in there, but these are the big whales folks. These guys got, big wallets and big um, funds in order to do that. I'm just doing my part, as you guys have seen on the video. So I'm going to show you guys the analytics. So all you numbers folks, guys or girls, you can get all the numbers and everything you need. Okay, so we're going to see right here is my current drops value. So now we're going to go out here to Dune. So what you do when you come out to Dune, click here and put in drip reservoir this pops up the reservoir it shows you how many drippers are actually in the drip faucet now you have to remember yes this is not the hundred and six thousand that we have in total because there are folks that have drip just sitting in their wallet they don't have a faucet wallet so they may have bought drip last year at a thousand drip last year at three dollars or seven dollars or something like that and they're just holding it till drip goes to five hundred dollars. So those are the difference. The other fourteen thousand between here, between ninety two thousand and one one oh six. Okay, here we have the numbers for the res for the reservoir. We have five thousand five hundred and forty one droppers. Let's see if that's about right. Because you scroll down here. Okay, so we got five five four two. It's close enough. Then, like I said, these are the analytics for all my the number ladies and gents that love to use the numbers. The contract balance of drops in the supply, 500.84. And that should be down here. Yeah, they're a little bit off here, the contract balance. Okay, we'll keep going. The total supply of drops balance in supply, 377 total minted 4136 total burned total invested and total paid out okay then they're going to they're showing the reservoirs monthly wallets over time how they've grown over time well now they're going to grow exponentially because now it's such a big drive due to the fact that everybody's getting a better understanding of how the reservoir can control and harden the drip floor price it's it's on and then the daily wallets view over time the drip liquidity and price of course up here somewhere is that 197 does it show balance in bnb oh that's just the balance in bnb okay and or is this here back in february that should have been right about yeah when we hit the 197 Okay, drops, liquidity, and price, the dividend balance, the daily, the total lock token balance, overall reservoir strategy, the reservoir wallet breakdown. So this, this is showing how much each of those 5,600 drippers have in their wallet. So I know I have 0 .00, 0 0.05, what do I have? excuse me, 0 0.055. So on the scale here, so those of us at 0 0.0, so I'm right here. So there's 104 of us that have between 0 0.05 and 0 0.06. Now, to see where you stand, for those that have contributed, we can see every single person in the in the uh, reservoir. This is why the blockchain does what it does. So let's see if I can find my wallet here. 
Okay, so this is the amount of drops. So somebody has 563 drops. And you got to remember, let me see the BNB price. Okay, let's hold on. I'm going to show you guys something here. Let's see how much it is for one drop. It was 13.7 yesterday. 0.6. I want to get as close as possible. 0.5. 0.4. One, two, bam, perfect on the nose. So 13.42 BNB. So here, 13.42 BNB. So it's $5,148. $5,148. Now that person that's in here that is getting has the majority of the lion's share has 563 drops. So one drop is 5,148 times 563. That person <laughs> is holding. Oh, no, that's a B and B. I'm sorry about that. So let's go back. 5148 times. They had 42 drops. 42 drops. 216,216. That's how much this number one wallet here is holding in drops. And it's a big gap between there and the next person in line. And as you can see, they get in the lion's portion of the reservoir um, dividend pool because it's based, your share is based on how much of the reservoir pool you um, are contributing or holding, however you want to look at it. All right, so let me see if I can go and find me. Of course, <laughs> we gotta, my, I'm going to be all the way down in the zeros. All right, so 0 0.5. So my OXE, I should be here. Yeah. O X E. Ooh, there must have been a whole bunch of folks that came in because I then dropped a few pages. O X E. Uh, nope. Well, let me get my wallet. Make sure I'm looking at the right one here. O X E two three. O X E two three. One more page. OXE, that's 5.4. So that's too low. Oops, well, I got to scroll down. Oh, okay, let me go back a page and scroll down. OXE, nope, not there. Go back 46. OXE, I'm on 5.7. OXE, Cause I'm thinking that it's it's off because OXE59. Do you know what folks? Let's do it do it the easy way. <laughs> I don't know why I didn't think about that. Just copy the address and go here. Where is the search? Right here at the bottom. Just plug in your address. Boom. There I go. So yeah, see? So drops held point oh point zero five nine. So it's not, I don't know how often it updates. That's why I'm looking at 0.55. Okay. So I'm on row 5541. So I need to go to 0.59. Okay. So let's go back and see where I'm sitting on it in the thing here. Okay. So. So point seven. So I should be here. A O X A two three. Uh, no, 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 no. How come I don't see it? Okay, these are the sevens. O X. A 
two, three. Okay, either I'm going in the wrong direction here. OX. Okay, here we go. Here's my wallet right here. Yep, 0.59. That's my wallet. Yeah, and that was the last time I made a purchase. But here, oh, did you see that, guys? When I went into the reservoir, that was the second day Drip was there. After the first, well, it came out on the 21st. And then I put a little bit of schmission <laughs> into the reservoir way back on the 22nd of April last year. The second day Drip was on the blockchain. So I'm going to keep on increasing. I'm going to probably put some in Friday after the Animal Farm opens tomorrow. So for all my analytical guys and gals, ladies and gents, here are all the numbers you can use to float your boat. And like I said, you can plug your wallet in here at the bottom and you can see exactly where you sit. So I'm on page 39 out of how many pages? 222. So, so people, oh, I guess they were, they were in here and then they pulled out. See, cause you can see over here, they sold or they withdrew. And you can see the ROIs over here. There's some great ROIs, especially not to have to have done anything. You didn't have to hydrate or anything. Just let it sit there. There's some 90 percent. I know the range they're saying is anywhere from 60% to 180% ROI. So let's go back. Just want to see a few. You see that 90? I see a lot of the 90s. I'm just going to 60s, 80s. Oh, I saw that was 100% ROI right here. This person got 100%. So like I said, folks, there's another stream of income for you. There goes 110. Whoa, 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 whoa. Back it up. There's one right here. 160% return on investment. That's what I'm saying, folks. There's so much money to be made in the drip protocol. Whoops, going the wrong way. So I'm just going to go back. We'll go seven pages since my number seven. One, two, three. There goes 120. Oh, holy guacamole. 200. See? This is what I'm saying, folks. This is from the blockchain. 279% ROI. That's what I'm talking about. And don't have to do anything. That's what I'm, they, I'm assuming they took theirs. Yeah, they withdrew on them. So that was what, five pages? One, six, seven. So we're going to stop there. So again, folks, the ROI is there. And remember, you're hardening the floor. And you're setting the drip floor price. All right, guys. So this is just a little bit of update on the reservoir. The new drip Animal Farm UI is out. Check the video out. And guys, remember, this is an individual endeavor into your crypto financial legacy. Drip has a community component. That's why we're getting ready to do what we're getting ready to do. And always increase your knowledge and reduce your risk. Never invest more than you're willing to lose or that you can lose because never anybody really wants to lose. But um, always do your due diligence. Always do your own research. I lost my train of thought. Oh, uh, I got to say my slogan. I got to say every time. This is for F informational educational purposes only. This is no type of financial advice because I am not a financial advisor. So do not do what I do because I'm doing it. You do your own research and you do what you're going to do because there's no one going to be responsible for your wins or losses but you. So, guys, thank you for your time. Engage.